do guitar picks matter? That is a real question I had this week, and it's a good question. And it makes sense because there are so many guitar picks out there. When you're getting started playing guitar, it's maybe a little confusing. You might not even know why there are so many guitar picks. And to be fair, there's lots of marketing stuff and gimmickry around picks. But the answer to the student's question is, yes, guitar picks do matter to a certain extent. It might be a little bit more subtle than you think. So we see all these different picks advertised of different shapes, sizes, gauges, materials, and they'll make you play faster or louder or sh shred or um, they created in such a way that they're so grippy you'll never drop your pick again. Those promises are, are pretty hollow. I think that you can achieve any of those goals um, regardless of which pick you are using. However, guitar picks do make a difference in the way you sound particularly with an acoustic guitar, right? There are oftentimes just less variables, uh, diff different, less places where you can adjust the sound, right? You don't have any, might not have any signal processing. You might not have an amplifier. It might just be wood and wire in the room you're in. And uh, at that point, the guitar pick does make a big difference. Okay, but here's how I see it. There's essentially kind of two basic sounds that I want to get out of my acoustic guitar. I want that light, airy, rhythmic, open sounding um, type of texture that I was playing in the beginning. And for that, I use kind of like the classic, thin, flexible um, guitar pick. It's perfect for this type of sound, this type of playing. It's so light and almost creates like a shaker texture once the guitar track is, is put into the mix with other instruments. It's very nice, it's very delicate. Okay, the other type of pick I like is one that's super rigid and super thick. Uh, this is the famous or, or infamous uh, blue chip pick that they make here uh, or make down the road in Knoxville, Tennessee. I like these because they are f super fast and they're great for flat picking. They have a really nice attack or transient part of the note. The initial part where you, we attack the string with the pick sounds really good. They're great for flat picking and single note playing. You can still strum with them too, of course, um, but you get a slightly different sound than you would with um, the thin kind of traditional pick. This is a bit more meatier, a little bit more aggressive. Uh, however, you can back it off and play very delicately with these rigid picks and you get kind of a, a familiar sound that is also really nice. Really pretty sound there too as well. You don't need a whole lot of, of muscle to get that sound out of there. So yes, guitar picks do matter. You can uh, get a different sound. In fact, it might be the cheapest, most expedient way to get a different sound out of your guitar, especially your acoustic guitar. However, a lot of the gimmicks and marketing stuff that is floating around out there, not really true. Know that you can Ultimately, what makes your guitar sound the way you want your guitar to sound is you and how you're playing it. Once you kind of accept that to be true, experimenting with different type of, types of picks and allowing them to kind of speak to you and see what different sounds they will produce when you're listening and paying attention is a great next step. Always having a few different guitar picks on hand, especially when you're playing acoustic guitar, is a great idea. So... Yeah, check it out. Go to the music store, get a variety of different picks, different shapes, different materials, different um, gauges, right? I would suggest, you know, a very light, thin gauge and then also something that's big and heavy and strong. And listen very, very closely to your acoustic guitar and see how it changes the sound. It will be subtle, but, you know, this, this, these subtle changes, these subtle nuances are what creates a lot of musicality within our playing. All right, see you later.